Rhubarb. Are you happy? Yes. I am very happy. Cheyenne is a very good boy. He will keep you happy. Mrs. Jabbar has seen the family very well. And, and Sister Shasta the Cheyenne's mother. She is very lovely woman. You will be very happy with her. Mrs. Jabbar has given the guarantee. It is enough for me that you are happy. Do you need anything? No. Be happy. Okay, sleep now. Good night. Good night. Good night. Please show your love and subscribe to our channel. Take this, why are you not doing the breakfast? Is Zoya awake? No. What does she want? I also do not know what she wants. The days she asked for. I have given her. I have given her enough time to think. I have let her meet a Shah. Why is she delaying it now? Ask her to make a decision by the evening. Otherwise, I will go to his home to talk to his father. Then no one complains to me. Why did I make a decision? No one says that. Dad. You do not need to go anywhere. I have signed the divorce papers. Whatever decision you make, I will accept that. Hello. Rubab, Rubab, please do not cut the core. For my sake. Tell, what is the matter? I want to meet you. But I do not want to meet you. Rubab, please. Please only for once. I said I will not meet you. Anything else that you want to say? Do not get married. Who are you to say that to me? Rubab, say whatever you want to. If you do not want to marry me that is fine. But do not put yourself in this test, you will regret it. I regret it till now that I loved you. There is no bigger regret in my life than this one. Do not make a call to me again. Rubab, Rubab, hello. said do not call me again. Do you not understand? I do not want to meet you or talk to you. Excuse me. Hello. Cheyenne speaking. Cheyenne. Yes, your fiancé. 
May I ask, to whom you were scolding? Actually, it was a wrong number. Thank God. I understand that. Anyways, tomorrow we will get engaged. We never talked. I want to meet you for once if you do not mind. Can you go for a dinner today? Please do not say no. No. Ask my mom. I have no issues. I will talk to aunt. I hope she will have no objection. You tell about yourself. Do you have any objection? No. If mom allows me, I will have no issue. That is great. Okay then. See you tonight. Bye. Okay. How are you? I am fine. Will you not ask me to sit? Have a seat. Sister Raisa told me you have committed rubab. She is right. You cannot take my opinion. But, you did not even consider it necessary to involve me. I did not ignore you intentionally. It happened spontaneously. They came to see the rhubarb. I had no intention of doing an engagement. They liked rhubarb and did the ritual. We have to visit the boy's family. I will take you with me. But do not think that, that I cannot marry Rubab without you. I know. Will you listen to me? I will take no money from you. My everything is of my daughter. Give your daughter whatever you want to, but do not try to give me. I will take no money from you. It is your daughter's marriage. Can you not end this annoyance? Is it not enough that I am involving you in this wedding? Will you not meet Rubab? I will meet her. But I came to meet you now. going to meet Cheyenne it is my husband to be's name may I go
please. Thanks. But why? You came on my invitation, that is why. You look very beautiful. Very pretty. Will you not say anything? May we order something? You seem in a hurry. I mean, do you want to go home early? Do not worry. I will not take more time. I will ask only a few questions. What? Do you really like me? I mean, are you under any pressure for this marriage? I do not know, but I feel so. No. It is not true. That is great. I will ask one more question. Yes. When I call you again, will you scold me? I mean, that wrong number. Thanks. Now let us order something. I love you a lot. You love me from a long time ago. Say something I am desperate to listen to you. I had no answer to this. I love you a lot. I will marry you. Serve downstairs. Go and have dinner. I do not want to marry. I do not want to marry. I do not want to marry. Zoya has sent the divorce papers. Where 
are you going? Downstairs. Why? Mom. Let me talk to Asha only once. You will not go downstairs. Rubab. Go inside. Mom. Please. Why? What has happened to you? Why are you forgetting that it is your wedding day? I have forced Sister Sajda for it. I have made many stories. That you were not well. That is why you came down the stage. Mrs. Jabbar is also making calls to me. Sister Sajda also made a call to me. If they know anything. That before marriage, you had. So what will happen? Did you think that? Mom, please, I will return in a while. I cannot allow you. Ruben. For my sake. Please. For my sake. Do not stop me today. Okay. Then remember one thing. If you go downstairs, on returning you will see me dead. Okay. I will not go. I will not go anywhere from this home. I will never leave. Sarah. Can you come to my place? Is everything okay? What happened? Rubab has refused to get married. What do you mean? She was going up me to Shah. I have stopped her with great difficulty. Please come. I will tell you the remaining story later. I am very upset. Okay, I am coming. Zoya. Zoya. Uncle, where is Zoya? 
Where is Zoya? Whatever you want to say, say to me. I just want to talk to Zoya. Zoya. What is the problem? Why are you making a noise? Come with me. Where? I want to talk to you in a separate. Whatever you want to say, say here. Zoya is right. She will not go anywhere. Zoya, you are forgetting that you are still my wife. Oh? I remember. Dad. He wants to talk to me in a separate. He claims that he is my husband. He is also right. We have a paper relationship. And until this relationship is present, he has a right to me. Although he has taken every right from me, but I will not take away their right now. Say, I have come. What can I do as a wife until we get divorced? Wait for you the whole night. Or to find you in the whole house. Or... I wish Rubab was here. I would bring her in front of you. Then my duty as a wife would be fulfilled. She is getting married. Oh? What do you want me to do? To ask her to refuse to get married. Please take your divorce case back. Why? I am very messed up right now. I cannot make any decision now. Asha. You do not have to make any decisions now. Because it is decided that this relationship between us is only for a few days. Can. Can we be good friends? No. It cannot happen now. Maybe I never make any friends again. I have already paid a lot for friendship. I should have realized it. When our friendship turned into love. Anyways. Do you have anything else to say? I do not know. Asha, do you know? Your biggest problem is that. You cannot analyze yourself. You realize very late. What do you actually want? Do you remember? When you used to express your love daily and I used to ignore. Maybe I knew that. What you consider to be love is not love. You took a long time to realize it. And still, you do not get it. Sometimes you follow Rubab, and sometime. Asha. Try to understand yourself. The day you understand yourself. You will save many people that day. And listen. From now on. Don't possess your right to be a husband on me. I do not want to have any expectations from you.
Where is Rubab? In her room. Okay. You do not worry. I will talk to her. Did mom invite you? Yes. At least with this excuse, mom realized. There is someone else except me, whom she can use. Sarah told me, you are not well. She would not have said that. Mom would have said that Rubab is refusing to get married. She wants to meet Asha. Is that what she said? Yes. She said the same. Why do you not want to marry? I do not know. My heart does not want to. Oh, no. I remember. I have stopped listening to my heart. I am out of my mind. But my child, Zara told me that you gave her the right to marry you wherever she wants. One who can give the right can also take it back. At such an occasion, all the preparations have been completed. Your invitation cards have been sent. Your Mendy rituals have been done. Rituals have been done. The wedding guest. Do you know Zara will be embarrassed? In front of many people. So do I get married because of it? I have also made promises. I am also embarrassed in front of many people. I also have likes and dislikes. You met Shayan. Then you made a decision. Me. I did not make a decision after meeting Shayan. He decided after meeting me whether he would marry me or not. Mom used to say that. Mrs. Jabbar said that it is a good family. But. No one ever asked me. Do you like Shane or not? Do I have any objection to this marriage? No. No one asked me. Yes. I accept that. Mom said in front of Aunt Saja. That. I will not. Make any decision without asking Rubab. I do not want her to forcefully accept my decisions. I go angry. And I said yes. Because I knew that. Mom will not ask for my opinion, but will emotionally blackmail me. She would say that she has done a lot for me. She has sacrificed a lot for me since then. But Dad. In all these things. Where is my opinion? What do you want now? I want to meet Asha for once. Despite knowing everything. Dad, do you know? Just like no one asked for my opinion on this wedding. I also did not give him a chance to Asha to prove himself. I want to give him a chance. 
And what will happen then? I do not know. Maybe I believe what he says. Or maybe I hate him even more. I will make this decision after meeting him. She is making lame excuses. She is blackmailing us. She intentionally gave me the right to get her married. So that I marry her to the Asha. Sarah, please, let me talk. You cannot do anything, because she has no regard for anyone now. She wants to embarrass us in front of everyone. Sarah, this is not the right way. You go outside and let me talk. Okay, dear. I will let you meet Asha. But you have to make a promise to me. You will make a decision after thinking critically. Does that mean that I will marry Cheyenne? No. Whatever decision you make. But remember that. I will not let you. Or your mom get you embarrassed in front of anyone. I will face people. Come, meet with a shah. Come on. I do not want to embarrass anyone. I am ready to marry Shine. सोचा था तेरा साथ नहीं एक धोखा था मेरे मान को राख बना डाला चाहत को खाक उड़ा डाला 